And what is going on, everybody? It is your boy Chance, also Shadow Blade or Yes Blade. Y'all already know the names. I ain't got a fuck with it a million times. Y'all already know who I am. But um, just so you guys know, I will be taking a two week vacay from music to actually sit down and train and practice racing again because in two weeks got it, two weeks i'll be getting my xbox one and i'll actually be performing and keating as a professional racing style gamer on a pro level after god knows how many years so Yes, I am taking two weeks off to train, practice, get myself ready. Um, I do have a couple of sponsorships I'll be looking into around that time. Because I do already have a couple of small-time sponsors from, oddly, a couple of skate companies for racing, which is weird, but it's whatever. Um, But um, I do have a couple of sponsors looking at me as far as, you know, YouTube goes. So I'll be doing that. But, uh, yes, I am going to be competing on a pro level. I'm super excited. You know, I've been I've been looking forward to this for a long time now. And to honestly say that I'll be able to compete on a pro level in two weeks, like, it, it's super exciting. Like, you know, words cannot describe how, you know, excited I actually am. Like, yes, I'll still promote people like my brother Marcus, who's actually the newest artist on Bloodshot Records. Uh, Marcus is actually not only, you know, my best friend from childhood, but he's also one of my brothers as well. Like, we grew up together. Like, he's family. So, yes, I'll be promoting his stuff and, you know, the usual shit. But for the most part, um... I'll be away from music for a couple weeks. I'll be sitting down, training, practicing, you know, getting myself ready because, you know, competitions for this year on Forza Motorsport 7 is coming up, and i got to get ready for that. Um, like I said, whenever I get X, my, my Xbox One here in a couple weeks, I will be adding everybody who has Xbox One. So if you guys do have... And you guys who have an Xbox Live account, drop your names below and I'll add you guys as soon as I get it here on the 25th. But guys, I can honestly say I am beyond excited. Um, Probably around this time next year, I will have a PS4, so I'll be able to do a little bit of Fortnite by then, hopefully. I don't know. I can't say for sure, but next year I will be doing the um, Seven Floors of Hell next year, so that's really awesome. I have a spot saved for next year, which is super cool, so I do have a job next year lined up. Um, Update on my arm. My arm's actually doing a lot better than what it was, as you guys can tell. I'm going to have a nice couple of scars there, but uh, other than that, you know, it's doing good. Uh, my shoulder's doing better than what it was. And it's still pretty sore, but it's not as bad. But, uh, you know, I can honestly say, guys, I am super excited to be going from the amateur level that I've been competing at for years now to the actual pro level that I need to be at so I'll be able to race you know professionally I'll be able to actually get real sponsors through my YouTube channel for this um you know I'll actually be able to make real money doing all this so that's super cool I'm super super excited like I cannot wait like, this is going to be a hard two weeks. Like, when I'm not doing dishes or promoting anything like that, like, I am going to be spending every waking that I can 
you know, training, practicing, getting myself ready. Like, I am super, super excited for this. Like, words cannot explain how amped up I am for this. Because, you know, this is something I've been looking forward to for a very long time. Like, ever since I found out that you can actually make money doing racing style gaming on YouTube. Like, it's always been a dream of mine to actually, you know, become a professional racing style gamer in any way that I could. And, you know, that's coming up in two weeks. So I am super excited. I'm super blessed to have this, the small sponsors that I do have. Um, they're not paying sponsors, but they do send me stuff to review every now and then. So that's super cool. But um, hopefully through this, I can start making some real money. Uh, not that I'm not already making real money through my music, but, you know, I've been doing a lot of music over the last few months. I've been doing quite a bit. Um, you know, I put out a music video. I remastered my very first song that I ever recorded. Um, I put out a lot of new stuff. So over this next few weeks, I'm going to be taking a break from my own music. And I will be busting my ass, you know, training through, you know, simulators like Absoluto Racing, um, Nitro Nation, Need for Speed Underground 2, the entire Need for Speed series minus Pro Street because I can't do Pro Street because my, which is basically my wheel is busted right now. Like it works, but I can't like use the controls very much. So I do have to wait on that, but that's fine. That's whatever. But um, but other than that game, I will be, you know, training my ass off. Do I, so if you guys do have Ocelodo Racing um, Simulator on Android or iOS, hit me up on there. Look up E-S-B-L-A-D-E. That's me. You guys can add me on there. Um, we can get into, you know, some lobbies, you know, do some drifters, do some circuit races, you know, do tag battles, like whatever you guys want to do. Like I'm down for that in any way, shape or form. I will be live streaming my practices a lot on here. So you guys can kind of see my progression of, you know, where I'm at now, and where I'm going to be at and what to expect. But, uh, guys, I am super excited, you know, for this, man. It's only two weeks. It's the 25th, which is only a couple weeks away. So I'm super excited. Like, I cannot wait. That's going to be super, super awesome. Um, I will have three months um, Xbox Live premium membership for three months uh, free because I'm getting the bundle pack. I'm getting the controller, the USB cord set up, uh, the console, and a crap ton of games to download for free. So I will be doing that, but um, I am I can honestly say, guys, like words can ask, you know, how excited I actually am for this. It's been a long time coming, you know, and there is one person that I have to thank who got me into the racing scene to begin with, who unfortunately are with us, which is my older brother, Bill. Um, he's the one that actually got me into the racing scene. Um, he had introduced me when I was a kid to the first Fast and Furious movie. And, you know, ever since, you know, I've been a very big fan of, you know, the racing scene. Like, I already grew up on, you know, NASCAR as a kid. Like, I grew up watching NASCAR, you know, Dale Earnhardt Sr., you know, Junior, you know, Jeff Gordon, you know, all the, like, you know. But I had no idea about the the street racing scene 
And so my older brother introduced the first Fast and Furious movie to me. And just right away, I was hooked. Like, as soon as I saw that first movie, I was like, all right, how can I do this? I want to do this. And then in... And then about late 2008, 2009, I had gotten my first ever professional style street racing game, which was Need for Speed Underground 2. And just ever since, you know, I started, you know, playing and, you know, from there I discovered, you know, soon after that, you know, once I got on Facebook for the first time ever, I discovered and that there's a whole community out there, that there's a whole, you know, community of racing and actual scene built around, you know, racing style gaming. And ever since I just dove right into it. Um, you know, soon after I got underground too, I wound up getting carbon. And carbon was amazing, honestly. It's one of my personal favorites to go back to a lot underground too. But um, soon after I got those, I wound up getting Underground 1. And then right after that, I got Pro Street. And then after I got Pro Street, I got Need for Speed The Run, which is another fun one. I love The Run. And then I wound up getting um, Need for Speed Most Wanted right after that. So, like, you know, and then after I started, and then right after I got most wanted i actually checked out the mobile games for need for speed most wanted and need for speed no limit which i'm a huge fan of no limits absolutely love it like they took need for speed to a whole new level with that so shout out to ea for that man i'm super happy with that game i absolutely love it like i can't stop playing it honestly like it's a fun game if you've not played Need for Speed No Limits for Android or iOS, dude, download that. You will not regret it. It's a lot of fun. But uh, I am going to be practicing, you know, my drag racing, my circuit races, sprints. I'll be working my basics. So, yeah, it's back on the grind for race season for me. Um... Two weeks of practice till I go pro. I'll be able to use, I'll finally be able to use the freaking drift pass for Forza Motorsports 7 that my good buddy Slap Train wound up sending over. So thank you, Slap, for that, dude. I'll be using that in two weeks, my dude. Shout out to Peter Jenkins, aka Slap Train. Much love to you, man. Love the videos, dude. Keep doing what you're doing, bro. Uh, shout out to my brothers, Ethan, Ricardo. Shout out to Elijah. You know, shout out to all the racing style gamers out there. Shout out to the entire car community in general. Like, shout out to everybody out there in the car community, like, for sure. Like, you guys are awesome. And I do want to say thank you, especially to someone very close to me, um, Nadia Loring, who has... You know, not only supported my music in a very, very big way, but um, she's also supported my movie, The Darkness, which if you guys have not seen that, go check that out. A very good movie overall. Like, I had fun making it. I had fun watching it, actually. Just watching it back was good. Um, There is a spinoff that's going to be done by my good friend Aiden Schroeder. Um, he's going to be doing a spinoff of The Darkness, which is going to be super cool. I can't wait to see that. That's going to be amazing. Like, I cannot wait to see that. That's going to be fucking awesome. But um, I do also want to say welcome to my brother Marcus to Bloodshot Records. Glad to have you aboard, little bro. Much love to you, man. Glad to have you aboard, brother. But as you got Marcus, I actually grew up with him. Um, me and him have known each other since, God, like, I wanted to fifth, sixth grade. Me and him met, and just ever since, you know, we grew up together. Like, we're, you know, we're brothers, basically. 
Like, he's one of my best friends in the entire fucking world. So, shout out to Marcus. Shout out to my sister, Rachel, who actually is his girlfriend and soon to be wife. That's super awesome. Shout, shout out to my brother, Sean, too, man. He's actually getting married in December. So, in December on the 1st, I will not be here. I will actually be at my brother Sean's wedding as his best man. I'm super excited. Um, I am going to try to film it. I don't know if I'll be able to or not, but I am going to try. And if I can't film it, I am going to get pictures for sure. I will get pictures of the wedding. Um, next month, I'll be going back home to my hometown. Back in Oregon, which is going to be super cool. We're going to be like an hour away from my hometown. Which is like right on the border. And so I'll be going back near my hometown in... Well, my hometown is Seattle, but we're in, we're going to be in Portland, Oregon, which is like right there. So I will be going back home for Thanksgiving. I am super, super excited for that. Like, I am immensely excited for that. I am going to be filming that trip. I am going to get pictures for sure for you guys. So that's going to be real fun. I cannot wait. Like, I am beyond excited for this trip because it's been almost 14 plus years. Literally, it's been about 15 years since I've been back home. So I'm super excited. I cannot wait. Like, I am super ecstatic trip. But, uh... Yeah, I've got a lot of big things coming up towards the end of this month, man. I can't wait. On the 15th here in a few days, my brand new song for Halloween called Lock Demon is dropping on Spotify, Amazon, Google Play, iTunes, all that. So you guys will be able to pick that up as well. But like I said, if you guys do have an Xbox account, you know, drop your account name in the comments on my timeline. Message to me. However you can get them to me, do it. And I will add you guys as soon as I create my account, get it set up. So, but yeah, starting tomorrow and actually probably after, while I watch Tsunami tonight, um, because as you guys know, I'm a huge anime fan, grew up on it, absolutely love it. So, what up to all my otaku out there? Love you guys, you guys fucking rock. Anime is fucking life, but um, while I sit down and chill, watch Toonami, I will be practicing a little bit here and there. So, if um, if you guys catch me on also little racing and you look up ES Blade. And you see me in one of the lobbies, hit me up, man. We'll do some runs, get some practice in. You know, I have a good time. But yeah, guys, two weeks. That's it. Two weeks, 12 days. Just 12 days, and I will be fucking ripping it as a professional racing style gamer. I cannot wait. Like, I'm super excited. For this, like, words cannot describe how hard I have fought to get to this point. How long I have busted my butt getting to where I'm at now. Not only as a gamer in general, but as a racer. Like, back in the day, I had no idea there was such a thing as being a professional racing style gamer. I had no clue. And when I did find out, I did not know, I had no idea how to even start a channel till about 2010 when I started my first channel ever, making AMVs for like four years straight, which got a lot of views actually. It was super cool. You know, I did a lot of AMVs. And if you guys don't know what AMVs are, they're anime music videos. You know, I had a lot of fun making those. I still do those from time to time. Like, it's a lot of fun making those. 
And so I may end up going back and doing that here and there. But, um, you know, I didn't know how to make a channel up until 2010, like I said. And then after that, you know, like around 2000, I want to say like 2012, 2013, that's when I started taking my skills as a gamer, you know, very seriously. Um, I made a few channels here and there, just contest out. They know, well, the DK Custom channel did go somewhere quite a bit, but I had to delete it because of drama and just really bad memories of my past of like, you know, my ex Abby and, you know, just a lot of bad memories. So then that's when I started up, you know, Retro Gamer, which is my current one. And so, you know, I'm really working hard to, you know, not only get that channel to where it need, but I'm working hard to, you know, to be the best that I can be, you know, not only as, you know, a gamer, but as, you know, a person, as a racer, as an artist, you know, all around better. And, you know, the one person that constantly pushes me that I know I don't speak enough about is, you know, one of the closest people to me, and that's Nadia Loring. Like, you know, and I just, I want to say thank you, Nadia, for everything that you've done. Like, if you guys don't know, this girl has gone above and beyond what anyone's ever done for me. I mean, yeah, a lot of people have gone above and beyond and actually done stuff for me. But the way she's doing it is far, far beyond what anyone's ever done for me, you know, at all. You know, like, she's really supported me in everything I do. Um, whenever I want to quit, you know, she doesn't let me. She constantly reminds me, you know, how much my stuff means to her and everybody in general. So, you know, that's super cool, you know, that she's, so shout out to Nadia, man, much love. And also shout out to Nadia's mom too, who supports on stuff too, that's freaking awesome. But like I said, guys, over the next two weeks, I will be taking a break to train and practice and recondition myself and get myself back to where I need to be. So... Yeah, with that being said, guys, I love y'all. Y'all are awesome. Be sure to drop your names down below. Make sure to drop your gamer tags in the comments or anywhere that I will see it. And then I'll add you guys, like I said. But with that being said, love you guys. And I'll see you guys music-wise in a couple weeks. And update-wise, I'll see you guys whenever I decide to go live again. Peace.